Atlantis Rising is going to be different than any other story about Atlantis because instead of focusing on the destruction of this magical island, this lost civilization, I'm going to focus on its creation. Atlantis has come to actually stand for every lost civilization that has ever existed. And it's been that way for 2,000 years since Plato first wrote about it. This book is about the birth of Atlantis, how it was born, the miraculous confluence of forces and, and heroic young people, a young man and a young woman, their burgeoning love for each other, the, the mysteries, the high stakes, the, the incredible surprises, the terrible evil that's, that's around them, them that they want to try somehow to overcome. Even amidst that triumph, though, there are the seeds of tragedy. And so the greed, the avarice, the, the, the lust for power that you find ultimately does come together and will bring Atlantis to its fabled destruction, but with a twist. At the end of my trilogy, you will see that even as Atlantis is destroyed, there is a way that it is still here among us all right now.